All right, it is the day after Christmas, and it's uh, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. I've been doing some video editing and stuff like that, and it's kind of a gloomy day, so just really not energetic today, but there will be a vlog. There's no telling what we end up doing, maybe going to Walmart or the mall or something with all the gift, gift cards that the kids got and stuff, so... We'll see where we end up today, but I'm working on YouTube now and taking some of the movies that uh, the kids got for Christmas and put them on our server so they can watch them on their Roku box and stuff so we don't have to play the DVD all the time and get it scratched. So, a lot of stuff going on today, and right now I'm enjoying a good old helping a Christmas meal and we got plenty more I'll probably be doing this all week and we still got a turkey that we have not even cut it yet so we'll have turkey uh, collards ham macaroni all kinds of stuff stuffing gravy cranberry sauce got a refrigerator full of food so it's going to be a wonderful week of relaxation making some vlogs and making some videos and enjoy some good meal and good family quality time well it has been a long day and here it is one o'clock on Tuesday morning and I'm just finishing up the vlog pretty much I've been sleeping all day because I've had a real long week before Christmas up all late at night be sure to get everything done, all my shopping and everything else. As you can tell in the other vlogs, what time I was at Walmart. And guess what? Here it is, the very first day after Christmas. And guess where I'm at? Yep. Back at Walmart. But we're not doing any shopping. We're just doing, getting some stuff, coffee creamer, and some cat food, and some other things that we need. We sure don't need no food for us. We've got enough to feed an army. But I still got to get back to the house, get into the studio, and make a video that I should have made yesterday, but... I pretty much just slept all day. I was tired. I'm still tired, but not so tired I'm sitting here and try to fall asleep. Go home, get me some coffee, crank out a video, get it posted, get this vlog posted, sit back and drink some coffee, and watch some TV. Because when January the 1st comes, that new schedule I set for myself to get going up 5 o'clock every morning and what I would be doing every day at a certain time to be on a schedule so I won't miss any videos posting for you and for business and everything. I got time set to the side to answer comments and stuff like that. Um, first thing in the morning, I'll be taking my vlog from the day before and editing it like 5.30 to 6.30. Gave myself time between there to edit and post it. Certain time I'll eat breakfast, certain hours I'll be working, 
I mean, I got it down to everything I do every day so I won't miss anything. Because I know next year I'm going to take all my channels to the next level. And hopefully you come for the ride. There's not really many people here in the parking lot like it has been for the last week before Christmas. But still, surprise me, there's nobody hardly here, as you can tell. I mean, the parking lot is almost non-existing, as you can see. Very few people. And that's just a security guard sitting there. But, uh, yeah, and we're not really that far out from the store. So it's not really many, many there. So it's what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ninth or tenth spot from the start of the room from the store, so we're not really that far out. There's just not many um, here tonight or this morning. Oh, it must be his vehicle. He's getting his keys out. And got this guy walking around like he's looking for his car. Have no idea what he's walking around for. Unless you don't know where his car is. It's not like it's real hard to find a car in the parking lot when there's hardly anybody here. And so far, my back window is still... Um, has not fallen out. It still looks like a spider web. Okay, I guess he's just going to move his vehicle a little closer to the front of the row, I guess. Because he was picking up the buggies. So apparently he's just going to park a little closer. So apparently that guy found his vehicle, looks like, over there. He's pulling out. I don't know what took him so long to find his own vehicle. It's not like the parking lot's full. So I don't know. I guess that was him. I didn't watch and see if that was him getting there or not. But at the area he was in. But now this fella, he's going to go back getting carts and put them back in the store. But yeah, I'll get back to the studio and put that video together. And I'll probably take the kids, the wife, take them to, I think they said they want to go to the mall. Because my son has like $75 for um, GameStop. And my wife has like 50 or $60 gift cards. So, and my daughter, she's got some money too. So they want to go to the mall and buy some stuff. So I figured I'll take them out there and and let them uh, spend the money and spend some time together while I'm at the house. Probably going to put some videos together. Try to get ahead of the game a little bit and go ahead and put it together, a video for Wednesday, and maybe be able to go ahead and crank one out for um, on Friday, too, to get ahead of the game a little bit. And if I have enough time, I'll go ahead and crank out some for next week. I already got video that I can put together, the title. It's just a matter of putting it together. But I'm going to have to really start cranking them out. Because if not, I'm going to get so far behind. And I don't want to do that here on this channel. Because, you know, i got a schedule Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Of having a video to come out. And plus vlogging every day. And as the year goes on, it gets warmer. I'm going to have more heat and air work. But if that gets too busy, I'm not going to stop the 
videos on this channel of the vlogs or the business videos. I'll just um, hire me some uh, service technicians and um, let them go out and do the work so I can continue to do this because I want to do this more now than I do heat and air because I've been doing heat and air for God, almost 30 years. I think it's two or three years. I'll be 30 years in this field. And I have been under and in the attic of uncountless houses in them years. I'm still in great shape. I don't have no problem crawling under a house or getting up in the attic, getting up on ladders or anything like that. I don't have no problem. So I want to kind of do some other things while I still can and still stay active and healthy and uh, live a long time. And next year, 2017, is when me and my wife is going to do more traveling, just her and I for business because I have some um, business trips already lined up for the year where I'm going to do some speaking so that's going to be what I'm looking for next year and I'm going to try to line up everyone I can and I'm not just going to do it in my backyard per se I'm going to do it wherever somebody wants me to go if they want me to come to California I'm going to California I give them the price tell them what they have to pay or whatever and what the requirements are to get me there and um, I'll be on my way and I'll take you uh, for the ride and if I'm there three or four days I'll be vlogging from there and I'll still make a business video no matter where I'm at as long as I got internet I'll be making vlog and I'll be making business business videos for this channel so I'm gonna let, end the vlog here and like always do something today that will take you to that next level so you be ready for next year to get your business off the ground or get your business started or a business you already have going and you get it up to that next level. So until next time, move up to that next level.